Some of you may notice that I've been doing more non-soundscape vids during October. For that, I apologize. To make up for it, I've not only published this pretty nifty feature on expensive as heck soundtracks, but also decide to finally, FINALLY talk about one of the most influential and legendary video game composers on this planet. No, not that one because we covered him. Oh, we'll get to him, I promise. Him too. I'm talking about Yasunori Mitsuda. The man, the myth, the legend. He is one of the few people ballsy enough to put his audio and sound job on the line in Squaresoft, just to prove a point, that he can compose an entire game soundtrack and make it the best damn thing ever in the company. And he did. But luckily, he didn't rest on his laurels. He went beyond his sound engineer job and made magic OST-wise. We're going to play all of his greatest gaming hits from his amazing debut in 1995 all the way to his most recent masterpieces. Minimalism, Celtic-inspired tunes, music ideas from Fever Dreams. This is Yasunori Mitsuda.
earlier on before this part in his career, Yasunori Mitsuda formed Prokyon Studio in 2001 as a company to produce his music alongside a record label, Slay Bells. Around that time, he was doing more work as a music producer than composer, managing different talents to make music under his label. Keep in mind, he's also a sound designer and producer by trade. So for the most parts, his contributions aren't as numerous as in 1995.
After doing much production work and talent grooming, Yasunori Mitsuda felt that he needed to get back to the swing of things. It was around this period where he started composing for notable major games, with one of them being his biggest solo work in 8 years. Essentially, he made a huge comeback to the genre he's always been fond of, RPGs. But before we head to that eclectic moment of his career, we'll have to go through his other works.
that is it for this long overdue soundscape episode. Thank you for tuning in to this special mixtape for this month of Chrono. We'll be doing more videos like this on this channel, on Facebook, and also on our website, Kakuchio Pure. So don't forget to like and subscribe to us if you love great video game content and lovely retrospectives like these. Until then, may you find your own moment of eternity.